I'm Dan Sheldon. In this video, I'm going to teach you all of my sprint and speed transition drills so you can start to improve your overall speed and explosiveness. High knees. Drive those knees up as high as you can. It's the same form as how we march, but faster. Remember to pump those arms and keep your chin and head down. High knees to sprint. This is a speed transition drill where we do high knees for five yards, then transition into a sprint through a cone at 20 yards. Speed high knees. Try to get in as many steps as possible in that 10 yards, and when you reach that second cone, take one explosive sprint step through it. Try to keep your head on that same horizontal plane throughout this drill. Speed high knees to sprint. Get in as many high knee reps as possible in that five yards, and then transition into a sprint. Speed skips. Keep those toes up and drive the ball of your foot into the ground. Try to get in as many skips as you can in that 10 yards. And don't forget to pump those arms and keep your head still. Speed skips to sprint. At five yards, transition from speed skips into a sprint. The key is to keep your shoulders forward so the transition into your sprinting is smoother. Explosive skips. Try to get as much height as possible with each skip. Drive those arms up to get that knee as high in the air as possible. This drill really works on that explosion off the line. Explosive skips to sprint. In this drill you transition from an explosive movement into a sprint. Quick feet. Take as many short, quick steps as possible. Your toes should barely come off the ground during this drill. Remember to pump those arms but in quick, abbreviated motion. Your body position should stay in that forward-leaning athletic position throughout the drill. Quick feet to sprint. The transition from quick feet into a sprint will force you to really drive your knees up to accelerate from short, quick steps into a sprint. Speed toe taps. Similar to quick feet, but we want to keep our legs straight and quickly tap our toes into the ground. This is a great drill to force you to keep that forward leaning athletic position throughout the drill in order to keep that forward movement. Speed toe taps to sprint. Again, keeping that good forward lean in the toe taps is what will allow you to smoothly transition into a sprint. Striders. Take long, bounding steps. Really stretch out that stride as far as possible. The goal is to take as few powerful strides in 10 yards as possible. Striders to sprint. This drill forces you to go from long, powerful strides into shorter driving steps. Bicycle kicks. Drive that knee up and kick out that foot just like you were pedaling a bike. This is another drill that forces you to keep your body tilted forward, which is what we want. Bicycle kicks to sprint. Really focus on the smoothest transition into that sprint as possible. And finish through that cone 20 yards every time. Shuffle. Face sideways and shuffle 10 yards with short, quick, explosive lateral steps. Make sure to keep your toes pointed forward and do not let them open up. Stay in that same forward-leaning athletic stance throughout the drill. Shuffle to sprint. Shuffle for 5 yards and then turn and drive into a sprint. Karaoke. Focus on getting a good, explosive crossover knee drive. Then swivel your hips and step behind the other leg, really forcing those hips to shift back and forth while your shoulders stay fixed and facing forward. Karaoke to sprint. This is another great lateral to sprint transition drill. Make sure that transition happens on that high knee crossover step. Back pedal. Keep your shoulders over your toes and drive backwards with quick controlled steps. Once you hit that 10 yard cone, spin and take a driving forward step. Back pedal to sprint. Transitioning from a back pedal into a sprint is the most difficult speed transition. Fall forward sprints. Starting in an athletic position, rise up on your toes and begin to fall forward until you are forced to take that driving first step. Keep your head and chin down and really focus on explosive first steps. Push up to sprint. Start in a push-up position with your chest on the ground and your chin tucked. In one fluid movement, push your chest up off the ground and drive your knees underneath to explode out of that sprint. Roll over to sprint. 
This time start on your back and quickly roll over to spring up into a sprint. This will force you to stay low and efficient in your takeoff. Receiver starts. Start with one leg forward and your shoulders over your forward toe. Really focus on driving off both feet as you explode out of your stance. Baseball starts. Start in a low lateral stance. Drive off that back leg as you turn to sprint. This works that lateral to forward explosive transition, so really focus on driving that arm through the transition. Softball starts. Start with one leg in front of the other. Shift your weight to your back foot and then build momentum to drive forward out of that start. This is just like a softball player driving off the bag when they steal. Track starts. Just like a sprinter coming out of the blocks, start with your feet slightly staggered and one hand on the ground. Then explode out of that start keeping your head and shoulders down as long as possible. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and start checking out all of my other training videos so you can start to invest in your athletic success.